now going to look at one shot zero so what I'm going to do I'm going to take a shot at the target this is where the point of impact is and we're looking through the uh, TNT 225R so it's gone low to the right so what I need to do now is go into the menu and we go down to zero in press the right hand button to get into it and the first thing I'm going to do is line up the cross with the centre of the target and once it's lined up we press the power button and it's froze it so what I'm going to do now we're on category A and we're on the digital zoom so from there I'm going to press the right hand button and go across to the X and then from there I'm going to adjust the windage so I need to go to the right uh, so I need to press the upper button sorry about there so I'm going to press the, the press the right button again now we're going for elevation on the Y so I need to come down so press the down button which is the lower button until the cross is level with the point of impact So I'm going to save that by pressing the right hand button there, long press of that. Now we're going to go on to the thermal. So I'm going to press the left hand button. Hang on a minute. In fact, we're going to, we're going to take a shot. Let's see if we're on zero. So elevation we're on, on. So I need to go right probably one or two clicks, so we'll go through that again. There, the right button to go into the zero and again. Now we're gonna press the right button again until we get to the X. And what I'm gonna do I'm gonna press the power button ok pressing the down button two clicks I'm going to press now the right hand button again long press oh. so press the right hand button again so this time we're going for the cross at the top because we're in thermal so what I'm going to do using the cross at the top it's bloody it's the trouble is it's finding the actual target can't really tell can you Okay, so that's gone to the left look on there. So let me just come out of this. Come to thermal. That's better. So 
I was aiming there and it went there, basically. Slide to the left. So back into the menu. Just come down. Press the right button to OK it. Uh, elevation's OK as far as we can see. So I'm going across to the 15. I'm going to put that in the centre and then I'm going to press the power button. Right, press it again. I think we're about right. Okay. I'm now going to press the right button, save and exit. Press cancel to that. Press the left hand button to come out. <coughs> Change the colour palette. That's better. Right, see if we can make a hot point on the target. Yeah, I can see the heat source lock. for the center because I couldn't see it under the dot, under the cross. see it where it's hot look so I'm going to reload okay this says a bit more meat on the bones there okay It's leaving the heat source. to menu okay 
save that. Neat on that. <sighs> yeah, more or less on. zeroed in on the thermal and on the digital but that heat swatch is really showing up where I've just shot which is just there look. now you will find that the the actual uh, crosses are misaligned between the digital and the thermal and that's just because they're offset and um, one's above the other so if you look up from the uh, digital yellow cross to the red, you'll see it's like to the right of the red. And the, uh, the actual digital is uh, probably an inch lower than the thermal as well. If you look at the alignment, That's about where we are. Now when it's in this mode, when you've got dual on, if you want to change the palette colours, press the left hand button on the scope and you'll change the palette colour. So it's white hot at the moment. No, it's black hot. So what I'm going to do now is raise the target. And we're 15 yards. See different uh, colour palettes also have a difference. So this is uh, black hot. I can actually see the target going black hot. And it's hit it using the uh, thermal now if we go to the top reticle which is digital so they show the bow form in their own right yeah using thermal now I'm going to use the top one which is the digital so at 22 they're still on ok use the thermal which is the green Both using the digital, which is a green bottom one, top, and finish off with thermal. Now back to thermal, let's see if we can create some heat sources. I'm going to go. See the red dots picked it up. And we're at. That's cooling off now, look. So, what I might do.
do now is uh, take it out for a vermin hunt. And it's getting quite dark now, even though it doesn't look it on the digital, it is. digital now okay so that's basically zeroing in the uh, DNT TNC 225R <laughs> 